In this video, I reveal how to do the vanishing juggling ball. But first, here's what happens when an old juggler is waiting on a friend. Hey! This snappy dressed fool is doing the vanishing juggling ball. Even the side view, it still looks pretty good. Okay, a third time in slow motion, I think you'll see it. What's neat about this trick is there's no gimmicks. You could grab some oranges in the kitchen and impress your friends and make orange juice. Okay, let's break this trick down. First, you need to learn the three ball cascade. If you can't do that, you're watching the wrong video. You'll need to be able to juggle two balls in one hand in a circle going from the inside out. You will also need to be able to juggle two balls in one hand while holding a third ball. This has to look real natural, like you're just doing two balls. Like don't all of a sudden start biting your tongue. This is an important part, I call it shadowing a ball. You're following one of the balls around as it's being juggled with the other hand. It doesn't have to be perfect because you want the audience to see the three balls. It's really important when I'm doing this trick for the two balls in my left hand to not change at all. This example is better when the ball is vanished the two balls in my left hand stay the same. Cue more mysterious music. This angle in slow motion really exposes the trick. Watch my right hand. I just let go of it and keep my hand in the same position. In this picture, I'm shadowing the ball. My right hand is going up. It's taking the place of the palmed ball. I let the ball go with my right hand and at the same second, I catch the second ball in my left hand ball in my right hand comes down and I keep the ball palmed in my left hand and throw up that next ball. The ball seems to have vanished. I had to figure out a way of making the ball return. First practice this multiplex throw. The ball should come up one above the other. Use your empty hand to hide the top ball. Here's another version I came up with. It's the same ball return. In the mid 80s, I got the idea for the vanishing ball from seeing someone do the eating the ball trick using a similar technique. 
I'm sure other jugglers have come up with similar ideas, which is great. Juggling is cool. <laughs>